morning, 47. Your destination is the Himapan Luxury Hotel Resort on the Chao Phraya River, just outside Bangkok. Your main target is Jordan Cross, the lead singer of The Class, a renowned indie rock outfit recording their highly anticipated sophomore album. But this millennial poster boy harbors a dark secret. One year ago, promising young actress Hannah Highmore fell to her death from Cross's penthouse loft in Dumbo, New York. According to the police, Miss Highmore's death was a tragic accident, but her parents remain unconvinced. They firmly believe that Cross murdered Hannah and only escaped justice due to the power and influence of his father, billionaire media mogul Thomas Cross. A secondary target, Ken Morgan, corporate fixer and attorney to the Cross family, is also staying at the hotel. Cunning and unscrupulous, Morgan was a key agent in the cover-up of Hannah Highmore's murder and Jordan Cross's subsequent acquittal. The Highmores understandably want retribution, and while the system may be powerless, ICA is anything but. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Bangkok, 47. Ken Morgan has booked the Queen Suite, but has yet to check in. You will find him in and around the restaurant. Oddly enough, Jordan Cross seems completely unaware of his presence. Cross and the class have set up a recording studio in the Emperor's Suite on the third floor. Private security around Cross and his entourage is highly capable. Still, I'm sure you can find your way into his inner circle. After all, today is Jordan Cross's 27th birthday. The age when rock stars die. Good luck, 47. Welcome to the Himapan Hotel. Thanks so much. Just ask a staff member Listen, if you need it. The theater was a nightmare and I'm not... Checking in. Name's Tobias Reaper. Thank you so much, sir. Here's your key card. Welcome to the Himapan Hotel. Welcome to the Himapan Hotel. Please follow me. I hope you'll enjoy your stay. Lead the way. Sir, please. This way. I mean, they rent a room and put up my paintings and then serve a glass of wine and some crackers and then take 50 percent. Please, sir, follow me. I'll take you to your room. All right there. Room by room, as if the noise wasn't enough. Oh. There goes my next ex-husband. Uh, here you are, sir. You can always call reception if you need anything else.
Hello, sir. Welcome to the Himapan. Let me know if there's anything I can do for you. We are at your service around the clock. Carry the heavy stuff, man. I mean, head up to the studio yourself if you want. No, oh, no, I don't want to seem pushy. I'll, I'll wait. Hope she didn't forget. So you think I will get to do some recording today? I got a lot of energy piled up from the flight over. Uh, look, I have no idea, man. Strong, silent type, eh? I recognize you. You're Ken Morgan. Yeah, yeah, they call you the brick, right? Keith McKenzie, U.S. Attorney's Office, South District. Keith? I saw you at the Chelsea Whitmore trial. Your strategy was the brassiest thing I've ever seen. The girl burned a homeless man alive and framed her cheerleading rival, and you got her off on affluenza charges? Stroke of genius, sir. I see. You're, um... I'm not going to give me the speech about how I'm part of the problem. About uh, how you will never embrace the private sector because you're fighting the good fight. And uh, well, justice is more important than money. Shit, no. The U.S. Attorney's Office is just a stepping stone to me. You don't buy a place in the Hamptons on a state salary. Hmm. Uh, Keith, Morgan. Uh, give my office a call. At Morgan, Yates & Co. We... May I have something for you? Thank you, sir. Will do. How are you doing? Hey, you checked the news site this morning? Apparently they found Bank Director Cobb's plane. No, I... they did? So do you know what happened? Was it an accident, or...? Well, that's the thing. They found the fuselage, but the black box is missing. Huh. What do you know? And Cobb's body? Nope. No body. But that's hardly a surprise. I mean, the plane disappeared months ago. The shark probably ate him. Hey, who's this Cobb guy to you anyway? What do you think that? It's Morgan. Mr. West. Hi. Why are you calling me at this hour? Slow down, Mr. West. I can't... Did you hit someone? Is that what you're telling me? Are you drunk? Where is the body? Did you leave it in the street? In the trunk? Oh, Mr. West. What were you thinking? You realize this could ruin your stock exchange listing. All right. We need to move swiftly. The cops work hit and run cases fast and hard. I need you to call my man in upstate New York, Fixer, by the name of Corvo. He will find you a suppliant. Someone who takes the blame, Mr. West, and does the time. It's a career, is it? Look, Carl, 
because they came from nothing, and they still can't believe their luck. Ah, the old Gatsby. Vegan birthday cake. It's ridiculous. Nothing to bed with their dietary fixations. First it was high carb, low fat. Then it was high fat, low carb. And now sugar is just evil incarnate, isn't it? Well, there's a limit to what you can do with dates and bamboo milk. I'm not a bloody magician. Like eat, eating a spoonful of cardboard covered in honey. Bugger this. I have a sense of pride. They can get to the top of themselves, finish their own bloody cake. Disgusting. No, it's just stupid. Someone left their wallet in their pockets. And it had at least a couple of thousand pounds. Why don't people check their pockets before sending them to the laundry? Well, did you keep them? No. I just think it's vulgar. There was at least a month's pay in that wallet. so close to the ventilation fan. Whoa, whoa, relax, Chief. I got it covered, okay? Besides, even at very large doses, this 
compound is not lethal. Darkness, smelling of sulfur type assholes. Look, it's no wonder some of the tourists have been here. No hotel staff, security, or guest, no matter how chummy with the band and or pregnant they might claim to be. Kitchen staff is the sole exception. Oh, and do try and keep quiet while the band is in session. Jordan is uh, sensitive today. Any other questions, ask the internet. Ciao. Hold on. Uh, oh, no, okay. All kitchen staff greenlit. This is just standard procedure. We're all friends here. And you're good to go. Thanks a lot. transported halfway across the globe. Haven't you heard the phrase, shop local? I'm sorry, Jordan. Do you want me to color sort your M&Ms while I'm at it? Ugh, never mind. Kissing sycophants to do the actual decision making. Where's the old vampire really? Huh? Take a nap in his coffin? Right. You do that, Morgan. Yeah, you do that. Asshole.
in Barcelona. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, that was crazy. So, it's back when soft currency just come out. Good to see you. Look, you want me to deliver it? Deliver what, mate? The letter, Neil. The one Dexy Barrett told you to take down to reception three hours ago. All oh, right. <laughs> no, I'm just comatose today. No, no, I'm good, thanks. I'll pop down in a moment. Yeah, so you keep saying. What do you care? Dexy Barrett is Jordan's manager. He's not the boss of us. Who's an old four, anyway? She didn't say. But he's staying in the Queen Suite, so I figure he's someone important. All the more reason to deliver his letter. I will. In a minute. And I wish she was my manager. Dexy, managing your shitty band. <laughs> nah, Dexy Barrett doesn't waste time on amateurs. She's a kingmaker, that one. Only works with the best. Well, I mean, she's been with Jordan in the class since the beginning. That's different. Few upcoming artists can afford to hire a superstar manager. Least of all, full time. Jordan can. He could have bought up monumental records without making a dent in his trust fund. Yeah, except he didn't. Nah, that's right. Hiring Dexy Barrett is the only privileged thing he did. He wanted to prove himself, do it right and true. You gotta respect that. Yeah, yeah. Still wanna punch him though. Seriously, why? Jordan's amazing, he's cool, good looking, and let's not forget, he's a kick-ass artist. Yeah, you know, I think you just answered your own question. Yo, chef! Hey, kitchen boss, what's cooking?
Bonjour, Chef. Exactly. Ready over here. So uh, bring on the birthday boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know the words. Okay, yeah. See you in a bit. Okay, guys. Uh, Jordan's on his way down. So, so get into position and uh, you know, fire up those vocal cords. Okay. Okay, so I'll sing lead, but you chaps better back me up. Don't just mouth the words. I'll know if you do. Oh, man, I can't wait to see the look on Jordan's face. He probably forgot it's his birthday. Does Jordan even like birthdays? Did he avoid this whole birthday thing by going sailing with a bunch of models last year? It's pretty decent of you. Don't mention it, darling. Have a taste. It's vegan. Yum. Oh, vegan, huh? All right. And you guys went through a lot of trouble, huh? <laughs> oh, no, no, no. It wasn't us. Your father ordered it. My father? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He was real particular. I mean, everything had to be just right for his son's big day, huh? Oh, did he now? right. The Algerian ones that I like. What an asshole. I don't feel so good. Yeah, but something, something's not... I think, I, think the, I think the cake... Um, okay, thanks for doing this, guys, but why don't we give Jordan a little bit of space now, okay? Next up, Ken Morgan. Help! Help! Hey, wake up! Something terrible has happened. There's been a terrible accident. Come quick!
found this on the stairs. It says good Queen's job, Chef. the envelope. I see. Very well, I'll take care of it. Ooh la la! Good day to you, sir. Panic, everything's under control. No. This must be the place. It, wait outside, Otis. Uh, negotiations are best done on equal terms. If you think that's best, sir. <laughs> Both targets down. Now head towards an exit.
Sorry, buddy. Security was just notched up. You know how it is. So, can't let you through. Seen Ramon? No? Uh, probably sleeping in a closet somewhere. <laughs> stripped clean within hours of the kidnapping. Someone wanted the son dead to lure out the father. Someone smart enough to stay in the shadows while we did the wet work, and the Highmores picked up the check. A shadow client. Someone got rich. The contract was just. That was the sound problem. I know you don't care about politics, 47. But ICA is neutral, or as has been. Can't allow ourselves to be manipulated. Besides... It's happened before. 
Italy, Morocco, Paris. All our clients got their intel the same way. Anonymous tips from a hidden source. Each contract perfectly legit, yet part of a grander design. I don't see the pattern. Somebody does. The board has asked us to chase down this shadow client, and our analysts are closing in as we speak. I know that tone. Someone's playing a game, 47. The question is, against whom? 